Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and in this video I am going to perform a few tests on this 24 volts 3 phase brushless AC generator. Now the power rating of this generator is 120 watts uh, with a maximum current flow of around 5 amperes. So we are going to perform few tests on this generator and this is a DC motor of the same rating 24 volts uh, but the power is only 52 watts. So it is 24 volts 52 watts and it is 24 volts 120 watts and you can see the size difference this is so big and this is really small and that's the quality of a brushless generator it gives a really high power with a smaller size and lighter weight when compared to a DC motor okay so first I'm going to perform the open circuit AC voltage test so for this I have connected the multimeter in 200 volts AC mode you can see the pointer in 200 volts AC mode and uh, since the multimeter has only two terminals so I'm going to connect the multimeter to two of the terminals of this PLDC generator while uh, one terminal will be left open since we are counting the open voltage then uh, the open voltage of these two wires will be exactly same as the open voltage of these two and these two So you can see uh, that it is generating around 13.1 volts AC. 13.1 volts AC. Now I'm going to perform the DC voltage test by connecting the terminals of this three-phase generator to this three-phase handmade rectifier. Now this is a three-phase bridge rectifier, and if you want to know how to make it, and then click on the link above. Anyways. I have connected the multimeter uh, to the rectifier and uh, it is pointing towards the 200 volts DC mode. So as you can see that it is generating around 17.8 volts DC. So it uh, the voltage generation has increased when compared to the AC voltage measurement that was 13.1 volts and uh, this rectification has stepped up the voltage from 13.1 to 17.8 or 17.9 volts so that's an advantage that's an open circuit DC voltage so in this third test we are going to connect uh, an actual load which is a motorcycle bulb and I'm going to operate it so let's see how it performs so yeah it is performing really good uh, with a perfect generation it is uh, generating around uh, 40 to 50 watts and uh, since the maximum power of this gen uh, this motor is only 50 watts so it cannot transmit mechanical energy more than 50 watts to this three phase generator so this was the actual load test so guys the last test for this generator will be the short circuit DC current test so I have shorted the terminal according to the instructions you can see that it is pointing towards the 10 amperes current mode which means that this multimeter can can measure the current with maximum value of around 10 amperes so it will measure the short circuit current so it is measuring 3.98 around 4 amperes almost yeah it is exactly 4, 4 amperes 4.02 amperes so the recorded amperes was uh, 4 amperes and also uh, I want to say that uh, this generator is still not operating at its full performance that is rated uh, power because uh, as you saw that the generated open circuit voltage was only 17.7 or 17.8 volts and uh, it generates the rated voltage of 24 volts this motor is not powering up this brushless generator enough to generate that amount of voltage and current 